Hey guys, it's Scott here at uh, Watermass Railroad, and as you can see, the uh, layout is quite the mess here lately. Um, yeah, it's been a while since I've done a video, but I figured it was time. Cora keeps bugging me to make one. Uh, let's see. I don't know where I left off. I probably should have uh, watched the last video. But, uh, yeah. Uh, I bought some wire here. Uh, this is four, four ribbon cable for I bought whatever, and um, I took the uh, the uh, that multi-roll wire that I got and uh, kind of right here spooled off some of the wires and um, I ordered actually some of this wire uh, in 200 I think they said it's 200 or 250 meter length um, five uh, rolls have arrived I've got the gray the white the red orange and yellow uh, I still have five more to come. I'm a little crooked there. I'm trying to do this video on my uh, Surface Pro. First time I've ever tried using this. Yeah, I dropped my uh, LG V30 and cracked the screen. It's not really bad, but I wasn't too happy, I can tell you that. Little upset. And I also ordered. Some more of these uh, relays for the switches. So I think I have enough of those. There's eight more here, which then... God, this is awful close. Uh, eight more. definitely prefer my uh, LG camera. Um, eight more, and there's four on here. I still haven't put that one in yet. Uh, I ordered... Uh, Five packages of these. Uh, it's awful dark here. I should turn that light on. Um, highway guardrails from uh, Pike Stuff. There's uh, six in a package. Doesn't go very far. So, anyway, ordered a pile of those. I ordered some of these uh, connectors, which I want to use for these relays and uh, my switches when I get them. I'm not used to this camera, it's so close. And, uh, so over at the hobby shop, and uh, I guess somebody was getting rid of all these little detail things. I bought a pile of them, they're only like a buck a piece. Well, of course, except for this one, which cost me ten bucks for three pairs of shades, which was expensive. Uh, I also ordered uh, these auto loaders. I ordered two of those. I picked up this uh, coal conveyor, old time thing, from the hobby shop they were getting rid of. I also bought uh, 10 more of these and I got another 10 coming and I also ordered from uh, Mega Points in Britain oh, my roof uh, the mounting hardware for these to mount the servos to the underside of the layout they should be here in a week I hope if I ever get them at a can to post and customs they freaking take forever to do anything and oh, way over here. Jeez. Oh, also, come here. Uh, ordered uh, some of these new speakers. Take them out here. These are these ones here. I guess go into the uh, iPhone five. Is it iPhone five? Yeah, these are the ones. 
Uh, Rapido uses these in the uh, SW1200 switcher, the one I have. And uh, I noticed when uh, I took it out, it had a uh, shrink wrap around it. I mean, I didn't take it off, but I was wondering why. But when I bought these, I realized why. There's a little tiny arm that sticks out of these. And when you snip it off, it leaves a little hole. You'd think it would have been solid or something, but anyway. So you just put a little shrink wrap on it, and it covers it in. Um, nope, that's not what I want. Why is that, uh, oh, it's this box. See, organization, I am not. Then, I thought I would also try... Good grief. I guess I should have opened these bags beforehand. Would have made life a whole lot easier. Well, you know, I like to do things backwards. Uh, do, 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 do. Ten of these, uh, these ones. I guess these are the ones that go in the iPhone 6. A little larger than the... Uh, the one that goes in the iPhone 5. I really haven't tested them out yet to see what they sound like. Because, and of course, I have to... Let me see, these are all the uh, iPhone 4 ones I bought. And the reason I went to the iPhone 5 and 6 to try it out was because you can no longer get these from a guy in China. Thanks to the arrest of the Huawei uh, CFO and all that bullshit that goes along with that crap. So yeah, some of the Chinese people have decided not to uh, ship to Canada. And it happens to be some of the guys I buy from. Which really sucks for me, but that's okay. And I also bought another one of these. The uh, P42 uh, Via rail for Matherin. It's a DC, but it's it was missing some parts. It's missing the horn, Sinclair antenna. Of course, these are missing the steps because they fall off so freaking easy. Because mine are missing. It's missing the windshield wipers. But other than that, it's in really good shape. Oh, one tank that I didn't realize when uh, when I bought it. Things seem so dark. Yeah, uh, I'll have to get one of the tanks from Athern, I guess. That was the only thing I didn't realize, even though it was in the picture. Uh, I think for the railroad, that is all the shopping that I've done that I can think of or see. And like I said, there's a couple other things coming. Um, I've got a protective. Uh, coating or uh, protector shield on the iPad. I got that. I also have a sheet coming. Oh, we'll go over to the other side of the railroad. To a decal to protect the back from scratches. And I've been working on yeah I'm staying with the phone camera because an eye. This surface is just too big to carry around for a for a uh, camera. So I've gotten most of the uh, Bell's Diner uh, done. Parking lot's pretty well finished. Uh, I've made a few changes every time I turn around here and do some work. I keep changing stuff. <clears throat> so where this is kind of empty, I'm going to put a piece into here. And then I'm going to bring this over and put a road into here. Yeah, then there's that uh, entryway there, so there'll be two. This will kind of be like for trucks to go in the back and stuff, even though people will be coming and going, but that's kind of the idea behind that, and I can fill this mess in. And then I decided to put a, a sidewalk that goes along here and then come over here, and then when I put this piece in, I'll bring it over and it'll come in here so that it'll match up. Um, this will all match up here with the sidewalk. So it'll cruise over to here. 
kind of finish it off a bit, I guess. And then, since I had this uh, overpass walkway, uh, I decided I'm going to use it here. What I'm going to do with this is turn it this way so that it'll land here. And then it'll go to the sidewalk there, or you can cross there. Maybe I'll... whatever. Not sure if I've got to leave this to go this way or go this way once this is all cleaned out and built, but that'll be a while down the road. Um, so I decided uh, the cars can enter in here to go into the auto, actually. I'll go get the uh, auto rack. Since I built one, it's not finished, it's not painted. Yeah, the floor's a mess. Two inches of water in the basement. Wasn't happy. A few things rowing flooding here. Hey Sparky, you know what that's all about? Good God, I can't reach. There's darn toolbox is in the way. Planning, planning, planning. Oh God. I really should have made a lift out, not a crawl under. So anyway, we'll stretch that there like that that'll sit like that so you know you get your little car cars you cruise into here and cruise up here onto the ramp and in you go and none of you can see what i'm doing because i'm not pointing the camera we'll try it again so yeah like you know you can have a cruise in here come all over um i've got a bunch of uh brass wire i bought or whatever the heck it is brass rod I'm going to make a chain link fence between here and here so that and then put a uh, an end so you can't get past here for cars so that the auto cars will all come in here and that'll be cut off there's an entrance in here this is a little parking lot that I decided to put in later lots of later after effects makes a lot of work a mess so yeah um, I didn't put a uh, uh, drive through here, but I might. I'm not sure. Like, so you can cruise through here and go down there. Not 100% sure yet. And here's a look down the road. I've got one side done a little, quite a bit more than the other. We'll crawl back under here. So when I put this road in, along here I just I was going to bring it up over the track and then you know go off as if it was a, a road going off in but then I decided well all these deliveries for these buildings I guess kind of suck you know the truck stopping in the middle of the road out there so I built a uh, a uh, road in the back here so the trucks could deliver and I pretty well got this side, oh jeez, almost dropped the freaking tablet. Uh, the building's all here, um, I need to get another one, I don't have all the kits that I bought, you'd think I'd have more kits, but apparently not. Uh, yeah, so just the one building there, then I'm going to finish these up, and where I had the post office before there, and the building there, that, uh, I don't know which one it is, but anyway. Uh, actually, there's the building there, and then that's the uh, post office. So those two will go here, the post office here, that building there. Here, I'll have to buy a bunch of buildings to go there because I don't have any. And I'm not 100% sure exactly what I'm going to do here. So I basically got most of these parking lots uh, finished and stuff. I decided to fill in because here these weren't filled in but I filled it in with some cork I bought a bunch of cork that's how I did all these things in the back road back there underneath is cork and then I just put some fine ballast on top I've got the uh, boulevards in here but I'm not sure I was thinking of putting the boulevard here so it kind of matches back here starting because then you get the turn offs like here turn offs and then and uh, a little boulevard here and then it will just end in the road uh, da, da, dee, dee, dee. eventually I'll get this gas station finished I still got to build a uh, 
canopy to go on top of the thing here and uh, and then here I decided to fill this in actually the reason I filled it in is because I always made too much uh, uh, CGC 90 and decided to fill this all in and make I'm gonna make it a grass hill all along here uh, I think it'll look better than what I had there so I think anyway so we'll try that out and as far as everything else I think that is it I don't think I've done anything else and well actually it's quite a bit of work for me actually and uh, yeah guys anyway this is getting a little long and I'm probably blabbing too much oh and yes toy man I've been making your LEDs I got something done for you so anyway guys uh, we'll talk to you again later for now we'll talk uh, geez here we go I'm gonna repeat myself anyway guys we'll talk to you later bye why didn't that